Well, hello there, folks, and welcome back. We are here today to go through the Lord of Order quest, and of course, this is because I'm remastering all of the old stuff I did years ago to put my actual current voice on it, because it was annoying me when I'd watch them back. Pristine Blades of Order are from Join Watchtower. They are dropped from the Corrupted Knights, or you can go and defeat the Chaos Knight boss if you prefer. Speak to Deathgore at Join Dreadrock, and just open up that shop right there for your donation receipt. Deadmore Spirits helped surprisingly is from Join Deadmore and it is dropped by the band She. Our next map is going to be at Join Citadel Ruins for the Mage's Gratitude, which is actually a quest rewards. When you get to Entropy, just make sure you accept this quest right here so you actually do get the drop. Then we're heading over to Ravenscar and you can access the shop here and buy yourself Ravenscar's Truth. Fortunately, only a thousand gold for that one. The Spirit of Justice quest is up next. So Warden Elvis defeated is of course dropped by Warden Elvis at Join Dwarf Prison. Piggy Drake punished is from Join Prison and dropped by the Piggy Drake that you can see. Mysterious Stranger foiled is from Join Mysterious Dungeon and dropped by the Mysterious Stranger. Then Calico Cobby crushed again this time you're going to join Dream Master and defeated by the boss you can see on screen. It is then time to move on to Purification of Chaos. So Chaos Roots, there's a few ways you can get these. I personally would go to Swindles Emporium at Join Turk, but if you'd rather get it through defeating monsters and not spending gold, there's a list in the bottom left for you. Chaotic War Essence dropped by Ultra Chaos Warlord from Join Chaos Boss. Make sure you grab 15 of those and you also need to get 15 Corrupting Particles dropped by Corruption at Shadow Gates. And then Purified Raindrops, 45 of these, dropped by Chaos Lord Lion Fang at Storm Temple. Our next quest is Steadfast Will. So for this one, we're starting off over at Join Geyazor for Geyazor's Cornerstone and dropped by the boss on screen. Join the Tree Titan Battle for Daka's Crystal, dropped by Daka the Dire Dragon. And then next up is over to Join Andre for Andre's Necklace Fragment, dropped by the Giant Necklace at the top of the map. And lastly, the Desolich Skull from the Desolich at Join Desolich, would you believe? The items we're about to get for Strike of Order are actually just normal boss drops, so you may have these in your buyback or your bank, so worth checking. The Hamazoon Dragon Koi Blade is dropped by Kitsun at Join Kitsun, and then the Supreme Arcane Staff dropped by Legermain at Join Legermain. Our next map is going to be Join MQ Lesson for the Dragonoid of Hours, and that is going to be dropped by this lovely Dragonoid that you can see. Next up, we're joining Maxius. This one's a bit different. Click on Sephiria, help with the fight, and then you can take the Spirit Orb. That will give you an item drop, so make sure you're accepting it. Ice Katana Brackets 2 is a reward from the Inferno Heart Quest over at Draconan, and I believe you just need to defeat the Living Fires for that one. It is now time to move on to Harmony. Unity of Life is dropped by the Tree of Destiny at Join Elemental. Then next up, Harmony of Solace is dropped by Faust at Join Orchestra. Our next map is going to be Join Cathedral. You need to go outside and defeat Pactagonal Knights until you have 100 of the item drops. Then we're heading over to Join Goose and just follow the route I take. I thought I'd include the whole route for this one because it took me ages. I was walking around aimlessly. Just get to this rubber ducky room and eventually you'll come across a candle area. Head to the right and in there you'll find yourself the Queen's Arch Sage. Defeat that and you'll get the drop you need eventually. Ordinance is our next quest, so for this one, join New Finale and click on Willow Creek. Once you've done that, you'll see Chaos Healers, and that is where you'll be able to get your item drop. Next up is Suppressed Drows. You need 50 of these from Join War to Wharf. Drop by various monsters, but all three on screen will drop them for you. 50 drops needed of Suppressed Undead from War Undead, and again, drop by literally all the monsters there. And then next up is Join Warhawk for more of the same type of items that we're getting, and you'll just be able to go through defeating the monsters. Then we're joining Join Weaver War for the Suppressed Weavers. Again, it is going to be times 50. If you join to Swordhaven, those dogs I showed you on screen will drop it for you. And Strength of Resilience is from Join X Tricky, dropped by the boss that you can see. Axiom is going to be our next quest. So Law of Nature is dropped by the Guardian Spirit at Join Elfheim. Then head along to Deep Chaos for Caffle in order to get your Law of Time. Our next lore is going to be Law of Gravity, which you can get from Join Necro Cavern, dropped by the Shadow Stone support. Join Black Hole Sun, and you need to defeat the boss on screen in order to get yourself the Law of Relativity. Then join Thunderfang, and you'll need to defeat the boss Torrent True for your Law of Conservative Energy. Then our next map is going to be just the layer, and you need to defeat the Red Dragon. Law of Low Drop Rates times 100. At this point, it is time to move on to the next quest, which will be the Blessing of Order. 
Doom Vault B is where you'll locate Undead Raxgore. You're going to need to collect 15 weapon imprints from him. Join Green Guard West in order to get your lore of order. Speak to Faith, go into the fishing gear shop, and presuming you are rank 7 on fishing, you'll just be able to outright buy the item, which is lovely. Join Mirror Portal and defeat Ultra Zhang. Make sure it is the Ultra version, otherwise you won't get your item. Join Yasaris for Inversion Infusion. You need five of those, and again, it is dropped by the boss on screen. There is a little button that you're able to press to join them quickly. And then that leaves us lastly with the final challenge quest. Join Ultra Dracov, defeat the Champion of Chaos, and that will get you your next item. So folks, as always, thank you very much for watching. Please do leave a like, and of course subscribe, and we'll be back to remaster yet another old quest line we covered incredibly soon. Until then, have a lovely day.